Hello, Ice Cap fans. Inside Mile One Center in downtown St. John's, I'm play by play broadcaster Brian Rogers with one of the two newest members of the Ice Caps defenseman, Patrick Cullity. First of all, Pat, welcome to Newfoundland Labrador. You're a good Massachusetts boy from Tewksbury, so you're probably familiar with Atlantic Canada. This has got to be a pretty exciting uh, turn of events for you late in the season. Yeah, it's been great. You know, uh, I was kind of back and forth with Springfield and Idaho, and I uh, got the call on Sunday that I uh, had been uh, traded up to St. John's and uh, very excited for a new opportunity. Um, have been here last year with Springfield and uh, love the place and uh, ready to get going. And I guess it makes it a little easier when you know guys in the dressing room and you and Kale Mullerot playing with Idaho. He's been tremendous for St. John's. He's looking to sign and stick. Have you had an opportunity to talk with Kale a little bit about what to expect here? Yeah, you know, I, I know he came in middle of the season and uh, he's a tremendous player. He was great in Idaho and we kind of knew he was going to be a spark plug in uh, at the AHL level as well. And, uh, you know, he just said it's, it's a good team. They work hard and uh, obviously there's been some bumps in the road so far, but uh, you know, hopefully can end on a good note and, uh, you know, end the season in the right, the right direction. Yep, 16 games going. You'll make your debut on Friday against the Hamilton Bulldogs. That'll be tomorrow night. You must be pretty excited. It'll be sellout, consecutive sellout, 69 and 70. So they pack them in here regardless of the night. It could be a Tuesday, Wednesday, or the weekend. This place is always full. No, that's exciting. That, you know, that, that brings a little more edge to your game, you know, when you have the fans behind you. Um, you know, we had a good crowd in Idaho, and, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be nice to come up here. And uh, I know Canada is big with the hockey, and, and so is the New England area. So I'm excited just to, to get out there and get that first shift out of the way. And uh, coming in here, when you look at the back end of the ice caps, extremely young now. Uh, so you're kind of coming in here. You're not that old of a guy at, what, 24? But it's almost like you're a veteran guy because you played in the league before. Yeah, no, it's, it's been a yeah, year and a half under my belt. I think my third year pro. Um, kind of see the ins and outs of uh, the game and at this level, and uh, you know it'll be a good, good, uh, good step, and uh, make him, you know excited for uh, Friday. Patrick's going to wear jersey number three for the Ice Caps uh, for the rest of the season here. Uh, let's talk a little bit about your background, Tewksbury, Massachusetts. We're exactly in the state of Massachusetts, which is a great hockey playing state. Is that? Uh, it's about 30 minutes north of uh, Boston, right near Lowell on the map. Um, yeah, so it's uh, yeah, not too far. And of course, obviously, when you're playing in Springfield, not very far from home, you must. Did you have a good following when you were playing for the Falcons? Yeah, it was nice. You know, about an hour and a half from home, mom and dad uh, able to come out and uh, see me play. Beats uh, being out in Idaho. Uh, they they didn't get out there that much, so. Uh, but, uh, you know, come back to the East Coast, uh, regardless, is exciting. And obviously next weekend you'll play in Portland on Friday night, Saturday night, Manchester on Sunday afternoon. I, I guess you'll probably need a few tickets for those games. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure Mom and Dad will uh, be excited to get up there. I uh, got family from the Portland area. So, uh, no, I'm looking forward to this weekend and then uh, taking it down, uh, down south to Portland. And your collegiate career, you played in Vermont, where one of our interns, Peggy Wakem, was a member of the ladies hockey club. Well, you played for the men's team. Did you know her? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know Peggy really well. Uh, we bumped past uh, a bunch over the, the three years, I think, that we were there together. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's a great support up in Vermont. Hockey is a big thing, both uh, women's and men's hockey. And uh, it's an exciting time of the year, I'm sure, up there right now with uh, both teams going into the uh, hockey's playoffs. Yep. Peggy uh, played with some intensity as a member of the female team. She said, you got uh, some intensity in you too, Patrick. Yeah, yeah, and I put, play on edge, you know, try to uh, win those one-on-one -on -one battles. But, um, you know, whatever I can bring to the team and, uh, and to help them on the back end uh, is kind of needs to be. How would you describe yourself as a player? You know, work hard, keep it simple. Um, you know, can add in some offense now, now and then, but uh, just, just steady and consistent. So, Growing up, who was your favorite player and who was your favorite team? It's probably a stupid question being from Massachusetts. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, yeah, I'd have to say Ray Bork and the Boston Bruins. I mean, you see them, uh, you know, constantly on TV, uh, whether it's Nesson or back in the day on UPN. Um, yeah, no, and then it was, uh, it was nice to see him get traded, became a Colorado fan when they won the Cup in 2001. Yeah. I'm not a gambler, but as soon as we were introduced, we shook hands and said hello. If I'm a betting man, you're not from Texas, baby. No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You've got the thick Boston accent. I love that. That's just one of the classics, and it's down-home hockey for sure. Patrick, thanks for joining us on 360 to enlighten our uh, viewers, and there's lots of them out there on the YouTube that follow the Ice Caps. We look yeah. forward to you making your debut uh, here tomorrow night against Hamilton, and we wish you nothing but the best success down the stretch here. Thank you very much. Excited. So in Mile 1 Center with Patrick Cullody for Ice Caps 360, I'm St. John's play-by-play -play broadcaster Brian Rogers. Have a great day, everyone.